So sets of fours. There's a lot of people carrying a small bag around like this these days to use for mechanical advantage and, and moving loads in the workplace. Here's a couple of different sets. This one's made with a conventional double pulley, terminated with a mayon to the centre and using a prusik for progress capture so that I can haul up my load and the prusik will hold it. This one here, it's quite a compact setup, again using a prusik for progress capture. The termination is a sewn termination on this cord. And again, as we take up, we can see this progress capture bumping automatically by the pulley. We've got another progress capture at the bottom end so that we, if we had a high anchor point, we could be working with that from the base. Now I'm going to come to this third one here, which is one that I've been experimenting recently, experimenting with. Um, it's basically the same as these two setups, except for a couple of differences. The progress capture is built into this pulley. So it's ratcheting past here and I can let go. I can put that to a park position if I want it free running, or I can just have it sitting here. But another, another feature that I've, I've set up in this system, that it, which is the termination of the, of the far end of the rope, and I've got a, a micro traction here, which is another small progress capture pulley. What this enables me to do is to have a, a fast take up two to one, pulling like this, and then when the load is too hard to pull, I can let go of one of those strands and keep pulling on the other with the four to one. <coughs> the other benefit of this system is I could, for confined space rescue, I could send the long end down to a person in the hole if they're capable of assisting. They could be pulling on one strand while I'm pulling on the other. So we can both be taking it even and taking it at different rates, it doesn't matter. And it halves the work that each of us has to do.